I'm Sister Rebecca, and I'm the archivist here at the Sisters of St. Benedict in Ferdinand, Indiana. Uh, all around me here, you see the archives. Uh, these are all boxes of the history of this monastery, which is over 100 years old, 150. Uh, we came here in 1867. So a lot of history has accumulated over the time. And then these here, these are boxes for each sister that has been in the uh, community and that uh, some are living and some are dead. But uh, there are various things put in these boxes that were pertinent to the life of that person. Uh, certificates, uh, uh, b baptismal certificates and then uh, graduation certificates and all those a lifetime of experiences goes in the boxes. The saddest part though is that in the sisters of the early years in 1867 to the early 1900s there's nothing very very little I mean, they, well, they had very little, but then th they were so busy working, they didn't have time for this. And it was only until the 80s when we really started this archives, and Sister Mary Kenneth Schisley, she was the one that gathered, she gathered all the things and, and into a room. And then in the 1990s, Sister Mary Dominic, the second archivist, archivist, came in and she took all, she sorted through all the artifacts and the documents and put them in boxes and then with a computer program has entered all that information in. Now, I'm the third archivist, Sister Rebecca, and I come here with my library skills which are organizing. And I come in here and take all the different files that have been put in and have begun organizing the information into a way. And we have a new computer program that we put things into. But you will find here the history of this monastery. Uh, it's uh, very interesting to go through. It's a life time for all of us here uh, and a lifetime that continues as this day goes forward.